Thanksgiving. Yeah. Should mama get that outfit for Thanksgiving? Yeah. What do you think? It's really cute. It looks super comfortable. Ooh, wait a minute. Should mama get this for Halloween? What do you think about this skeleton? Green skeleton for Halloween? I kind of like this. But I will never wear it again. Um, my mom is still visiting. She's here for a few more days. She leaves this Saturday, but we've been having a lot of fun. And today we went to Target and I got a bunch of random stuff, mostly clothes for the boys. They had some really cute clothes in Target, um, like kids clothes and lots of just like basic neutrals. Now that it's like getting a little bit cooler out um, and for fall and winter, I wanted to get the boys some more clothes and I need to like go through all of their clothes. I need to do it with my stuff as well and do like a big donation um, pile again for everyone's clothes because a lot of the things from last year well most of the stuff they don't fit in there's like a few sweatshirts and stuff that they still fit in but for the most part they only have summer clothes so I wanted to get a bunch of things for fall and winter I'm going to show you I got a few Halloween stuff um, Quentin picked out his Halloween costume <laughs> which I don't know if he's going to change his mind because he's I feel like he liked it in the store but I could totally see him not wanting to wear it come Halloween for Camden he picked his two Halloween costumes out online. I think one he plans to wear to school, the other one he wants to wear when we go trick-or-treating. Um, and I bought those from Target online. Um, he's gonna be a skeleton when we go out trick-or-treating. And for school, he's gonna be one of the Spider-Men. Spider-Man, <laughs> I don't know which one. So anyway, I had not gotten Quentin a Halloween costume and I really wanted him to be Tarzan because he's got like the long hair and I feel like it'd be perfect for him, but I can't find a cute Tarzan outfit. And I don't want his like chest out because it might be a little chilly. So I, I was thinking to get him like a nude, le like long sleeve leotard and then put like one of those cute little like sashes around his waist or um, like those little skirt things. But I can't find a nude leotard that would fit him online. If you have any ideas, let me know. But I just think he'd be the cutest little Tarzan. But when we were in Target, I had to pick out an outfit just in case. I can't find him a Tarzan one. So I'll show you what he chose. But yeah, let's go ahead and get started. Also this, how cute is this? I ordered this from Amazon. They have so many different colors, prints. This is like a sleeve that you put on top. It like comes off, it's removable. It's, I think this is like half a gallon. It's like a ton of water. This is pretty much what I need to drink for the full day. It's like close to 70 ounces of water. It might be like 65 ounces. So I'm trying to drink this, like one full bottle of this every single day. And it does come with like one of those cute straps that you can strap on. So. Like if you're out on the go or if you're going for a walk or whatever, it's easy to carry. But Amazon, I will link this down below if you guys want to check it out. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and just get started with the boys' clothes. So I picked this Star Wars t-shirt up for Cam. He's like really getting into Star Wars lately. Um, he like watched all the movies. Not, maybe not all of them, but he watched a bunch of the movies with Alex recently. But this is really cute because it's like Darth Vader. And then you like take the sequence and you push them up. And then it says the dark side. So I thought this was really cute. He's going to be so excited for this. Okay, then I bought him these black distressed jeans. These are by Levi's. And I specifically bought those jeans because picture day is coming up for Cam. So I wanted to get him a cute little outfit. And I found this adorable button down. It's like a dark charcoal gray. And then it's got the little silver lightning bolts on it. And I thought this was so cute. It's very Cam. So... I think he's gonna wear this with the black jeans and like a belt or something. Okay, some long sleeve like thermal material shirts for Cam. I got him a black one, just like very basic, but you can wear these with literally anything. And I think these are so cute. I got him a white one and then I got him the dark gray. And I buy him kids clothes, like this is all Cat and Jack brand, um, but I buy him the kids size now, so I buy him the small. Sometimes extra small, it depends. Um, but I don't buy him like the 5T toddler size anymore because he's grown out of that. Um, okay, so how cute are these sets? So this is the top. 
Spider-Man sweatshirt. Pam still loves Spider-Man. And then these are the bottoms that go with it. So cute. And then I got him this sweatshirt with some matching bottoms. I love anything um, camouflage print. And then I got him these sweatpants to go with that camouflage sweatshirt. Now we're on to Quentin. That's everything I got for Cam. I got a bunch of PJs for Quentin. Um, I'll show you those at the end because they're at the bottom. But I got these really cute like Heather, Heather cream color um, sweatpants for Quentin. And I've been buying him 3T recently. He is like two and a half, but I just don't want things to be too small. So I've been buying him 3T. I bought him those. I bought him these cute jeans. How cute are these? These are actually 2T because they looked a little big. Like the 3T looked too big for him. But if this does have an adjustable waist, it says, and it's like, they're stretchy. So, and then this adorable flannel for like Thanksgiving. I got him a cute little matching camo set as well. This is like a hoodie with like a zip going all the way down. And then these cute little matching joggers. This adorable little set, the Marvel, Marvel Comics. For Quentin. I'm going to try and link everything down below for y'all too. If you guys want to check out any of this stuff. Um, okay, let's get into the pajamas. <laughs> I got him so many. Um, okay, so this is a set of two, very cute for fall and winter, the moose and deer and fox, raccoons, and then on this side it is this set with the moose head, the little striped pajama bottoms. My kids like live in pajamas, <laughs> so I really have to get them like plenty of pajamas. Um, and plus Quentin and Cam. I need pajamas for Cam, but I didn't find any for him. But Quentin has grown out of like all of his summer PJs, so... Um, got him this set. I love the olive green. This has like the bear on it with the long matching bottoms. And then on this side, it's got like all the different animals. So cute. I love the colors of this one. And then I got him one more set. The, uh, the pants fell off, but this is a Yeti one, not Yeti for bed. I thought that was really cute. And then it comes with these pants and then this side with like the little Yeti again and the matching pants so he's set with the pjs although i did get him a new pair of halloween pajamas as well as cam i got them some really cute ghost pajamas not today but like a few weeks ago and then i need to get them thanksgiving pajamas and christmas pajamas as well i love getting a matching pajamas for the holidays it's just so fun all right this is the costume that quentin picked out he did stitch he was really excited about this. Cam and Quentin love Lilo and Stitch, so, um, and I got the 2T for him. We'll see if it's, it looks a little small, honestly. <laughs> Might be too small for him. We'll see. I'm going to try it on him, and then if it doesn't work, we'll just return it and pick something else out, but it's got, like, the little mask. Kind of put it over your head like that, so I think he'll be a really cute Stitch. I got Quentin a little candy bucket to bring out for Halloween since he will be like trick-or-treating and like going door-to-door -door this year. Last year he was just in the stroller and just chilled. This year I think he's gonna love going door-to-door. -door. Cam has one from last year. He's got like a big one so he'll just use that. And then this is so random. I needed a new little um like a rinse shampoo rinser thing because ours had like mold in it. It was super old so yeah so I got a new one of these. I got two huge bags of candy for Halloween. I always get these super last minute. I just felt like um, Target had so many different kinds, so I just picked them up now. Um, Quentin had me open this one because he wanted some Skittles, so that's why this is open. But I think this will be good. And since we are going to be trick-or-treating, I'll just like put like a couple bowls outside for the kids to run up and grab some. I got this for Cam. It's like a skeleton wand, a light up skull wand. And since Cam's going to be a skeleton when we go trick or treating, I thought this would be fun for him. And then last but not least, I bought a umbrella stroller from Target because I have like the Uppa Baby stroller in my trunk. It's so big and it's like two different want two different parts that you like put together. Um, but it's big and bulky and like it's perfect for a baby, but not really like Quentin has kind of outgrown it at this point. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and put it away in my garage. When we do go on walks around the neighborhood, I, I get that one out. But this one is lightweight and easy. And I'm just going to throw this in my car so that I have something for Quentin if he doesn't feel like walking when we go out. And it was only like 25 bucks too. And I thought the Mickey Mouse was cute. So I picked that up. Um, and I think that is everything I got. But again, I will just link everything for y'all down below. I think the kids, cute, the kids clothes 
specifically are so cute right now. So definitely go check those out. Okay, I actually completely forgot to show y'all these two pillows I bought today. So I thought these were so pretty. First of all, they are the softest things in the world and I loved this color. And I wanted to bring a little bit of a deeper color to this bed because everything is pretty much white and then I've got like the light taupe pillows back there. But yeah, I wanted to bring like a darker color so I picked these up and I think they look cute. And then I've just got like this lumbar pillow in front but they're just so soft. Oh my gosh, I couldn't resist myself. But let me know what you guys think if you like them. I think it looks cute with this leopard throw. Looks cute with that. And I feel like it just makes my room look a little bit more cozy. It's 2 a.m. and I can't fall asleep Cause I'm not tired I'm thinking about the days we used to shine When we were young we finally got to Trader Joe's and I picked up some stuff from there. I didn't do, I didn't go too crazy, but I did get some, like I repurchased a couple things that I absolutely love. They were out of my jalapeno sauce, which is literally why I went, I went there to get the jalapeno sauce and they were completely sold out. They said they're going to get them in next week. So I'm going to have to go back for that, but I did pick up a few new things. So I will share everything I got. Um, so I picked up some baby tomatoes and fresh mozzarella that is marinated. Um, if you guys have been watching my stories lately, and I think I shared it on my last vlog as well, but I've been on um, like a kick of having mozzarella with tomatoes and the balsamic glaze that I found. Let me just show you all real quick what this balsamic glaze is in case you didn't see, but it's the Nona's Pia, Nona Pia balsamic glaze. It is amazing. So anyway, I picked up some baby tomatoes. I got some mango. Um, I got the boys these little bars. They love these, the Trader Joe ones. Um, so they have pumpkin right now for fall. And then I got apple and strawberry. Um, some spicy jalapeno chicken sausage. This is great in the morning um, to make like a little egg burrito or just some scrambled eggs with sausage, toast, whatever you want to do. This is so good. And I like cooking it in a pan and like kind of browning it. Um, I want to try this out. I don't know if it's good. I think I've seen... Is it Tara? Tara Henderson has been eating these and they always look good. This is the jalapeno beef stick. So we'll see if this is any good, just for a little protein throughout the day. Um, these are the Trader Joe's Bomba Puffed Peanut and Corn Snacks. I have not tried these, but they are opened because Quentin has been munching on them and he's obsessed with these. So he was like eating them in the store the whole time. Um, and then I got some dips. So this is the creamy cauliflower and jalapeno dip. I haven't tried it yet. Looks pretty good. Um, and then got the everything but the bagel Greek style yogurt dip. I've had this before and I think I'm gonna just eat this with like veggies like carrots, cucumber, stuff like that, just to snack on. And then here is the uh, marinated, marinated mozzarella balls. Okay, so I got two of the Trader Joe's barbecue rub and seasoning with coffee and garlic. I've talked about this for years and years, you guys. And I, I had to get two of them just because I don't make it out to Trader Joe's that often. And I run out of this like very quickly because I use it on like everything, specifically chicken. It is so good if you're cooking chicken. Um, picked up some of their jumbo cinnamon rolls. These are really good. Um, this is new, caramel coffee almonds. So we'll see how these are. Um, and then I picked up seasoned kale chips. I used to buy this all the time and I haven't had it in forever, but this is a really yummy snack that is pretty healthy. Some pumpkin bagels for the boys. Um, some frozen stuff. So this is the butternut squash mac and cheese bites. My mom said these are very popular. So I thought these would be good for the boys to try out. Um, and then the harvest spaghetti squash spirals. So it's just spaghetti squash um, with chunks of butternut squash in a seasonal tomato sauce. I just thought this would be easy for me to like throw in to eat um, since I am doing keto still. Uh, and it's spaghetti squash. So I picked up these turkey corn dogs. I have seen these every single time I've ever gone to Trader Joe's. I've always wanted to buy these for the kids, but I never have. Um, and I like that there's no nitrates or anything added. And um, Cam really likes corn dogs. He has them at school. So I figure the boys would like these. And then, of course, I had to pick up the organic silver dollar pancakes for them because they're obsessed with these things. And that's it, you guys. I did not go crazy. Um, just got some necessities. I wish they had my jalapeno sauce. <laughs> Really sad about that, but um, yeah, I'll let you guys know how like these dips and and uh, the frozen stuff is and these 
These look so good. I honestly didn't see too much pumpkin stuff. Like the pumpkin bagels, there were like a few pumpkin things, but I just didn't go crazy with the pumpkin this time. Um, but yeah, that's everything I got. Leave me down below your favorites for Trader Joe's. I am gonna try to go back next week to get that sauce. So if there are any like favorites that you guys are into right now, leave them down below in the comments. Okay, so it is my mom's last night here. She leaves tomorrow. So I think we're gonna make these Reese's Mini Pieces cookie kit. Um, make some Halloween cookies tonight. And then we're gonna do the Chocolate Scary Graveyard. I got this from Publix, yeah. So I think we're gonna do this with the kids tonight. Is this the graveyard? Yep. Wow, um, this is beautiful, honey. But these right here are um, ones that we ran out of space for. Oh yeah, there's no more space two for Two purples left and two oranges left. Yep. Ooh, it's spooky. Which one are you gonna eat? For right now, we can only eat these and, and oh, you it on to get this. You can what? First we want to eat these and then the Dante. Okay, gotcha. Yes. So you're gonna eat either a purple or an orange? Uh-huh. Yum. Okay, so um, I just got dressed, put on some jeans. Yes, please do not look at my closet. It is an absolute pigsty. Like I've got all of these clean clothes folded all over the floor and I need to hang them all up. It's like a bunch of t-shirts and stuff mostly, but I wanna go through all my clothes and donate. I think I said this already, but donate a bunch of my clothes. So. Right now, my closet is an absolute mess. Anyway, just got dressed real quick. I'm wearing my cute little cropped thermal from Nordstrom and some Target jeans. I need to find um, some shoes. But uh, my mom and I are going to go out to dinner tonight. Um, it's her last night. She leaves tomorrow. Um, but she will be back for Thanksgiving. Um, but anyway, we are just going to go out and enjoy some dinner. And I think I'm going to go ahead and just end the vlog here. But I hope you guys enjoyed it. I'm talking weird because I have my Invisalign in. Um, these are my retainers, but I'm supposed to wear them for the first two months of getting them full time. And then after two months, I only wear them at night, which I cannot wait for. <laughs> but anyway, I'm going to go ahead and end the vlog here. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I will have all the links down below for everything that I showed. And don't forget to give it a thumbs up, subscribe. I'll see y'all in the next one.